everybody, this is V, and welcome to Designs by V. Today, I don't have a clue what I'm doing. Yesterday, I didn't pack at all because it was raining, and now today, I'm just like not in the mood. I've just been sitting in the garage. I did do a little bit of rearranging and packing, but... Not what I was supposed to do. I heard a car, so just looked. So, um, yesterday I didn't do any packing, but I, I went to to Burlington and then to um, where did I go? Burlington and Joanne's, and they got quite a few things there. Later, I'm going to, I'm going outside. I'm going to go to Hobby Lobby. I heard they had a 90%. Not like I'm going to get anything, right? But I'm going to just go look. So, in my pack, in my pack, and you remember I told you I'm not closing the box because then I go back and I look in certain things and I have other things that could go in that box to make like a full set or like-minded items. So my so again, I'm packing, but I'm not taping the box. I will write what I put on the box because I find myself having to reopen the box, waste and tape. So I was looking and realized that I have these out never use them they were thrifted um turn it to the side because i don't want to um blind you and these are placemat placemat i didn't even realize i had so i have three of them and if you look in the back of it you're going to see a dollar five that's that store that sells stuff for all five So there's three of these placemats. And I also, at this same store, found these. And I have to have these about a year now. But, like, I didn't know where they were. I came home. Sometimes I come through the garage with my stuff. I don't take it upstairs because we're not using it. And I just totally forget that I picked them up. And this one here was 205. And let me see how much I have this size. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh no. Five. Five of them. So let me see. One, two, three, four. It's six. You remember the one that I shown you? I put it to the side. So I have six of six of these. Six of the octagon shape. And um, three of the oblong ones. And I don't know what else I'm going to find that I didn't realize that I had. But I am going to come right back. Oh, no. Let me show you this. I forget. This was sitting right here. Do you remember I told you about the blue and white pieces? But I have a vase to this. And I don't know where the vase is. This is done in a sort of Tuscan look. And this is like a cement look on the top. And this is how it, it is. And I have two of them. But again, there's a vase. The vase has the body of this. And it has like two metal handles. It's a good size. But 
I don't know where it is. So I guess with me just putting all these things together, eventually I will find it. I have I have this piece here. Hmm. A while. Maybe maybe this piece is older than my youngest, fourteen. But when we moved into this home, I had it packed away. I never used I never used it. So because I, I usually keep this piece like over the cabinet that the cabinets that I had now didn't have the space for over it. So I just put it to the side and I seen it since I moved here. I used it once, but then put it away, but I've never used the candle stand. I will be actually, I could just do this right now. You know what? I'll be back. Cause I don't want to break those um, place mics. I'm back. This is another piece that you remember I told you I was packing trays, um, the metal trays. And I shown you the goblets and the, um, the copper tray and the leaf tray. Here is another, um, brass tray, all brass. And I had this many moons ago. I wouldn't be able to, um, when I lived in New Jersey, I purchased this and haven't used it since I moved here. So that see the reason why I am not I am not closing up any box because I don't want what I don't want is a little bit here and a little bit there and then having to put them to and you know having to search through all these boxes to put things together. I don't want to do that. So now you get my drift. Okay, I'm going to go into the lovely copper that I told you about now. This piece here is a new piece. And I purchased this here in Palestine. Um, myself and my husband, as many of you know, we took a trip to Israel. And Palestine is another country close to Israel um, where Bethlehem is. And just right outside of Bethlehem. As a matter of fact, it has a camel in the bottom of it. Um, yeah. And this here is like a milk warmer. This is what I will use it for. It maybe uses other things. But, you know, sometimes you make coffee, but you don't want to pour cold milk in it. This, would, this is what I will use this for. I also have the strainer here. I bought it from... Um, Tuesday morning and I paid $4.99 for this I'm trying to go a little faster I think I've shown this before this was $5.99 <laughs> this was $5.99 from Dirt Cheap and I am not editing this out um, this piece right here copper I purchased this piece in New Mexico. Oh, one second. I'm trying not to make this go real long. I have this piece here. I purchased this piece here from Goodwill. And this is a drinks, drinks canister. And it's in a pineapple, $2.99. This piece here, I had it many moons ago. And it's a little um, pot that you can make a little dish in, a little saute pan. I had these a long time ago. These are um, like sugar or whatever pour you want to use it for. This right here, I bought it from Tuesday mornings. And this was $7.99. The pump for soap or lotion. And this one I'm going to use it in my kitchen. I have this piece here. Um, this is a um, can opener and this was $4.99 from Burlington. I purchased these here. As you see, none have been used. Um, this is $5.99 and I got this one here from Burlington. This one here was $2.99. It's copper with um, stainless and that was $2.99 for three pieces. So some could get quite pricey and some, you know, good price. 
$2.99. This was on sale. It was regular $5.99. And I got it for $2.99 from Burlington. This is another. This is $3.99. See, they're different prices. And they were $5.99 before from Burlington. And these are like your spatulas. The one with a hole in it. The... This one here, $5.99. I paid $5.99 for this one until I went back and see the others on sale. But I didn't have my receipt. I have these um, thongs here. This was um, $7.99. And this was on Tuesday morning. I purchased these here, yeah, thongs. And this, I think, was $5.99 from Tuesday morning. This is a set right here with... Four pieces, um, kitchen pieces, and this was, I think I paid $7 for these. It came in a canister. I have the canister over there. This is the old piece that I have, and I cannot remember how much I paid for it. These two here are spoon rests, and I purchased a book for them from Burlington. They were $6.99 a piece. Another one again. So I have two of these. I might have three. <laughs> oh yeah, I do have. Oh, I have four. Um, another one again. And another one. Oh, I didn't know this one. No, same size. Yeah, and they were $7.99 a piece. This here is another scoop, and that was $7.99, like you could dip your flour or whatever in a big jar. I think I showed you the jar earlier. I also have these here. I purchased them from um, Steinmark. They were on sale. I think I paid a dollar for the, um, the measuring spoons. Here I have another set in um, copper, and that was two. It was $4.99, and I got it for $2.99. And this one here, a dollar and change from um, Tuesday mornings. I got this here from Ross, copper again. And this one was $5.99. I got this little mallet here. And this was on Tuesday morning, $7.99. And this is also copper. This little grater here. And this was $5.99. Um, this year is a, this is from Onita Company. These are from Onita Company. And um, I repeat myself. And this one was $3.99. This is a peeler. I got this piece here from Burlington, $1.99. And here's a fork that I got here um, for $4.99. And I paid $4.99 for it. Pizza cutter. Copper, $5.99. And that's about it for now. I think I did good. Yeah, I think I did good. So I'll be back with some more copper because it's leading up to my humongous copper pots. Can't wait. Anyway, this is V and welcome to Design by V. Thank you so much for watching my channel. The feedback is lovely. I love y'all for watching. Keep it up. I'm keeping the videos coming and I just appreciate you so, so much. See you in the next video. And you're going to see me in the same outfit. I'm going to just turn right back around and after I put these away, this and this away, come back and do another one for you. Bye-bye.